what's going on my friends and welcome back once again to terry's theories i am terry all right guys i know it's been a week or so since i posted a video but i've got two that i want to share with you today now we're going to start off in fairbanks alaska now this is recorded in 2016 yeah a couple years ago and what we've got is a security guard who is making his rounds when something in the sky catches his attention now he starts to see this and he sees a light that is hovering in the sky relatively low um, and it's blinking and then he said that something fell from it a light fell from it and went straight to the ground well as he's recording this about a minute into it two lights are released from it and they take off in different directions and then in a minute or so later it repeats and does the same thing so i want you to take a look at this give me your opinion tell me what you believe that this object could be all right guys check this out here we go There was another one before I saw this. And it went straight down to the ground over there. Some I don't know. Wow. Oh, oh, there it is. What the heck is that? Wow. Oh, oh, there it is. Kind of tweaking with my eyes a little bit. Why? Zoom out. It's really weird. Whoa. <laughs> putting putting out drones, man. <laughs> Scouting the area, I guess. Whoa. <laughs> putting putting out drones, man. <laughs> out in the area I guess Whoa, that moved really quick. Been waiting for something like this for a while. I'm gonna get something like this on my night shift.
gone. Nothing. Wow. <laughs> that was pretty cool. All right, guys, so what do you think that we've got going on here? You know, flares don't behave in that manner. It's not a plane. It's not a helicopter. Um, it appears to be stationary and then releasing uh, these uh, lights or whatever they may be, and they take off in different directions. So give me your opinion. Tell me what you think that this object is. Now, our next video takes place in Seattle, Washington. It was recorded on July the 2nd of this year, 2021. And we've got a bright light that is coming towards the camera, coming towards the, the guy that is recording this. And as it does so, you start to see the top of it. It's like a barrel shaped. Um, it appears to be a fairly large object being the distance that it is and then how well we can see the outline of the object. Take a look. Give me your opinion. Tell me what you feel that this object could be. All right, guys, here we go. Look in, look what I'm videoing here. Just quick, 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 quick. Look what's on my screen. Tell me what that is. Oh. That's odd. What is that? Exactly what is that? Is it right there? Is yeah, look at it. Look. Look. Tell me what it is. Look, look, there's something, uh, something, something over there as well. Look. <laughs> Alright guys, so how do you feel about this one? What do you believe that we are witnessing here? What do you think that this guy caught on video? Now, in my opinion, it looks like he's moving at a fairly good pace. Uh, it's moving towards the camera as he's recording it. And as it gets closer, you can see that we have a, uh, a dark dome-shaped or barrel-shaped top to it. So what do you think that it is that we're seeing? What is your opinion on that as well? Now, another thing, the, the recorder did a really good job of zooming in and zooming out to give us as a viewer an idea of the surroundings around this object. And also it goes... It lets us kind of judge the size of it. So it's always important to zoom in and zoom out when you're recording a sighting. All right, so I guess that's really about all I got for today. Now, if you have a video that you would like to share, share with the group, hey, you can send me an email at terrystheories at outlook.com. And I'll be glad to take a look at it and we can discuss it and then we can uh, maybe post it on the channel and then we can talk about it as a group all right so i guess that's all i got for today as always thanks for stopping by and remember to like and subscribe and if you'd like to donate towards the channel i've got paypal and patreon and we're always looking for new members on patreon and all monies earned through patreon or through paypal it goes towards back towards the channel and to help me to make better videos or maybe buying equipment or whatnot as it's needed but um i guess that's all i got guys thanks for stopping by this is terry with terry's theories terry out